6.10 kilograms of calcium fluoride is reacted with excess sulfuric acid. The reaction yields 2.90 kilograms of HF. Calculate the percent yield of the reaction. So in this problem, we are also given the balanced chemical reaction as you can see on the screen. So let's solve this. We are given 6.10 kilograms of calcium fluoride, that's CaF2. First thing you're going to do is to convert kilograms into grams. So we know that one kilogram is equivalent to a thousand grams. So one kilogram of CAF2, that's equivalent to a thousand grams of CAF2. So as you can see, the kilograms of CAF2 would cancel. Now we have grams of CAF2. The next step is to convert grams of CAF2 into moles of CAF2. So how do we do that? We will use the molar mass of CAF2. So we again, we convert from grams of CAF2 to moles of CAF2. So we will use the molar mass of CAF2. So you can do that by looking at your periodic table and adding the molar masses of calcium and two fluorines because in CAF2 there are two fluorines. So one mole of CAF2, calcium is 40.08 plus two times 19 because fluorine is 19 you will get 78.08 grams of CAF2 in one mole. So the grams would cancel out. Now we have moles of CAF2. And then we convert the moles of CAF2 into moles of HF. So again, from moles of CAF2, we will convert that to moles of HF. Now, how do we do that? We look at the balanced chemical reaction and look at the ratio between CAF2 and HF. So as you can see from the balanced reaction, there's one CAF2 and two HF. So that's the ratio. For every one mole of CAF2, it produces two moles of HF. So the moles of CAF2 will cancel out. Now you get moles of HF. And then from moles of HF, you can convert this into grams of HF. So from mole of HF, you can convert that to grams of HF. So we need the molar mass of HF. So hydrogen is 1.008 plus fluorine is 19. So one mole of HF, that is 20.008 grams. So let me just write that. So as you can see, the moles of HF will cancel out, and now this will give you grams of HF. So now what you can do is you can solve this entire thing. Okay. So grab your calculator and type there 6.10 times. 1,000 divided by 1 times 1 divided by 78.08 times 
2 divided by 1 times 20.008 divided by 1. And then you will get approximately, so if you solve this, this is equal to 3126.25 grams of HF. But if you can recall in the problem, it talks about the mass in kilograms. So we can do additional step and convert this into kilograms. So we know that 1,000 grams, that's equivalent to one kilogram. So the grams would cancel out. So basically that is 3126.25 divided by 1,000 you will get 3.12625 kilograms of HF. So this one that we solved is called our theoretical yield. So this is the theoretical yield. From this, we can... Con we can compute the percent yield because the problem is asking for percent yield. So percent yield is equal to actual yield divided by theoretical yield times 100. So our actual yield according to the problem is 20 point, uh, sorry, 2.90 kilograms. So that's 2.90 kilograms divided by our theoretical yield is 3.12625 kilograms times 100. So 2.90 divided by the, th the theoretical yield, 3.12625 times 100. So the percent yield is about 92.8%. So this is the answer to the question.